Pitiful dragon. Okay. <laughs> no boss fight. What just happened there? Uh violence. Violence happened. I felled the rotting old oak. He's not dead. No. I have something else planned. Spectacle, remember? You have won, Ivar. And if you will not kill him now, then let him go. Humiliation will chase him to the end of his days. Oh, no. This will be good. I have something specific in mind. A place and a method. Come. All right. Let's get this over with. Load this lump of lard onto your horse and we will go. Take care he stays alive. Eivor, <laughs> do not forget that load of rotten flesh called Rodri. Hold on. Roman artifact, where? A second he did not burn to a crisp no but i'm guessing he got some scars off of that okay give me a second here guys this is bugging me this is bugging me i want that artifact Check this out. Uh, 
Okay, we'll come back to this later. I kind of want to finish this off. Get up. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, nothing there. It's a book of knowledge, yeah. Put you down. Something's up. So this is too easy. Where are we going? An overlook I found while scouting. A view, one fit for a dying king. There's no need for spectacle, Ivar. Let the man die with honor. No, no, no. He must die with style. This is cruel. This is cruel. This is cruel. This is sadistic. This is gross. <laughs> How are you doing, dear king? Stay with us. You must not miss what is coming. This is gross. He spared your freaking life! Hey! You trying to hurt me? I killed King Ella, King Osbard, King Edmund, and now King Rodri. Who else can claim such a string of victories? Just finish me. It is not my place to interfere in this feud. Guard your loins, it gets bad. Oh, great. Valhalla must look such a sight. No, I've seen Valhalla. It doesn't look like anything like this. Does he breathe still? Barely. Rodri, are you listening? For years, I wore this scar with shame. Nicked by a Briton and left alive. I tried to cover it with a beard, a cloak, but as your fame grew, I began to beam with pride. A king gave me this mark. What say you to this, Rodri? Huh? Speak up, you old bag of sweat and grease. I don't feel good about this. Here we are. Bring him close. This way. I don't feel good about this. to the top and keep him breathing finish this quickly Ivar see here a hungry blade now come 
becomes the dragon to feed on his favorite meal, the blood eagle. Ivar, is this? The birth of a blood eagle is a sight to behold, my friend. First, I slice the length of your spine. has no true meaning for Ivar. He is doing it simply to take pleasure in suffering. Now, I pull back the flesh. The method will always outlive the meaning. <laughs> Few in time will care why this man died. But the how, that is a song for the ages. between good and evil grows thick over time. But glory never fades. There is nothing glorious here. Life is not pretty. It is a bloody fight. Ow! Oh, come the lungs! And we spread them like wings! <laughs> Not finished, Eivor. This saga we have written together, it needs an ending. Here and now. It is ended, Eivor. I'm done with this place. A fight to the death. You and me. If I win, I am the greatest Vikinger who ever lived. If I lose, what a tale you have to tell. You are battle drunk, Eivor. Goodbye. Poor Chelbert. He barely said a word. When? I pushed that dragon dagger into his heart. No. Just a soft little squeal. And nothing. You sick, cursed fuck off! The things a man must do. The trials one must face. The friends one must betray. To achieve one's destiny, I'd become king killer forevermore. Traitor! Chilbert was like a son to me! Yes! Yes! So fight me, Wolf Kiss, to a glorious death! Oh, I'm going to kill him! <laughs> and I'm going to this enjoy it! This is life anymore! To fight high above the world! Valhalla! Rip his head off. I agree. Oh, I'm going to look forward to this. I hope you burn. Yeah, that's right. Struggle. Take your tongue. Will you see your father in Valhalla, Wolf Kissed? Or is the coward in Helheim weeping tears of ice? Gold again! You son.
Valkyries approach. My axe, Eivor. Hand me my weapon. No. Eivor! Give it here! To Helheimer with you. Eivor! Carry the body to Quadford. We will say our goodbyes there. And send a message to Uber. Tell him his brother is dead. That was a lot. And no, I haven't seen how uh, uh, abridged. I don't know if that was the right choice to make. The eagle thing in Colbert. Yeah, no, I. <sighs> Again, I don't know if that was the right choice to make. But, oh, damn. Agreed. Agreed. A man like that does not deserve Valhalla. I denied him Valhalla too. I don't care what your excuse is. I don't care. He shed the blood of an innocent, which is not honorable at all. just to fuel his petty agenda. Are you playing getting this game, Wolf? Yeah, no, that, that, that made my blood boil. I knew he did it. I knew it. He tortured an innocent man to death in the most gruesome way possible because he got to live <sighs> sorry Eivor, hello another dark day clouds our victory bishop uber dead in the hands of a britain I cannot imagine the shame my brother felt in his final hour. Were it not for this peace, I killed him. You? After peace was made, Eva murdered Chelbent and pinned the crime on Rotary to get another swing at him. How do you come to know this? He told me himself. I am always one who desires the truth, Eivor, but this. This is a hard thing to hear. Did he die well? What do we say? What do we say, guys? He did say he wanted the truth. Did he die well? Die badly or he wanted death.
be honest with his brother any other votes what do, what what do we think do what do we say a few more seconds five four three two one he wanted death death at my hand was his final aim he wanted the glory of a bloody end an end you did not deny him with Ivar gone peace and quiet are now possible that is something I will console myself for the thought that we will meet again in Valhalla axe in hand for good or ill he lived life by his own rules. What man can say better? He lived his life at cross purposes. I often found him strange and his actions puzzling. But not all men are meant to be understood. He needs a proper farewell. I will prepare a ship for his funeral pyre. Bishop, send word to Lady Angharad. Say that her husband died by treachery. And that Ivar has paid the price for it. As soon as I am able. Have you heard from King Cheolwulf? I cannot imagine his grief. He is felled by it. Still, he makes plans for this shire. I am to be Elderman here. Therefore, Shiropshire declares herself your friend and ally, and will remain so for the length of my days. I'm grateful, Bishop. God go with you, Eivor, wherever you may lead. sails into a singing glory on flaming water steeds. Wind across the water. The battle maidens beat their wings to carry a king to Odin's hall of corpses. Ivar gone. Shirepshire an ally. I should confer with Randry. I have no words. I have... No words. Um... That's gotta be the hardest quest line... Um, in the game so far. That... Did not make me happy. Yeah, that was a lot. Yeah, it's... <sighs> I don't know. I, I, I don't know what to, how to say it. It is... Kind of disgusting. Um... Ivar is a bastard. And a coward and he deserves what he got in Helheim he deserves to burn I am going to be honest he deserves completely what he got and I do not feel any regret towards it I know I'm playing God here um, but man I am so angry.
like that 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 made me angry um okay who would have given jim valhalla jim him valhalla though i don't know i don't know I don't think he deserves Valhalla. With, like, yes, die well. Let's be honest here. Die well. He did not die well. Not in my mind. Killing an innocent man who did nothing wrong. The boy just wanted to make you feel better. And how do you repay this? You s literally, you literally stab him in the back. Just to get your petty vengeance and sadistic. Tear his back open even. Yeah, exactly. Well, no, that's a different thing. Your personal grudges aside, that was personal. That was 100% personal. And in my opinion, personal grudges should be taken out of politics. Um, you should have your personal vendettas settled outside of politics. If you wanted him that badly, he could have challenged him. He could have snuck in and killed him. He could have fought him man to man. There are situations. Oh man. I'm at a loss of words here. Um, I need to use the bathroom real quick. I will be right back. I will not be long. Uh, we're gonna do some side questing before ending the stream. Um, but. I will not be long here. I'll be right back.
Ships on bigger of the waves are skimming barren summits to the verdant plains. Each horizon is a new beginning. Rise and rain. Far from the fjords and the ice cold. I am back. Did, did you guys watch me? Well, so calm down a little bit. Uh, did you guys miss me? I just talked to my brother. Uh, I love the games like this one, the ones that bring emotion into it. I do too. I think storytelling like this is fantastic. I think this is a prime example of fantastic storytelling. I think um, um, if a game can make me that angry, it's done its job. Um, I, 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 however, am more invested into this than most people. Nugget! Hello! Hello! But, um... Yeah, in general, Datora, I, I, pl I love playing games like this. You're gonna see a lot of games like this on my channel. Uh, that are going to be like this. Uh, that are very, very story-driven. In terms of... And um, because I think that's 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 what's enjoyable to me. Um, I know it's not necessarily the most popular thing to do on Twitch. Like it's it also makes conversation really really difficult. Um, it, it it's it's not the most popular thing on Twitch, but I think it's 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 room for discussion for one. Um, it allows us to talk about what just happened in the chat and see our opinions and feelings. Um, I also like games like this that do multiple outcomes um, to see what people did because it's it, very interesting. I actually would have loved to see like a scale um, of who let, how many people let, um, how many people sent Ivar to Valhalla versus how many people denied Ivar Valhalla? I would love to see a ratio in terms of answers and see how many people chose what and when. Like, it would be very, very interesting, at least to me. I don't know if it would be interesting to you guys. Um... But man, that's rough. Ooh, that's rough. Like, this is... Ironically... I think this was my favorite quest line so far. Like... Being real here, I think this was my favorite quest line. I think this was my favorite story arc. I know I lost one of my favorite characters. Chilver, my love, my boy, my precious child. <laughs> but, like, I, I enjoy, I'm replaying Odyssey and choosing different options to see different endings. When I've completed this game, I'm going to do the same, choose different options. My boy! <laughs> like, it actually has a lesson here. A, a very interesting conversational uh, topic going on right now. <laughs> Um, is what people would do for the sake of vengeance and what you need to lose in this for the sake of vengeance however another thing I want to point out is basically Ivar and Eivor were like father and son in this situation uh, um, husband and wife in this situation I want to say like Eivor was like the calm collected mother that loved her child no matter what and wanted to see what's best for him and then Ivar was like the and then Ivar was the the um the strong-willed father and it's his blind rage 
and his lust for vengeance literally cost them their son's life. At least that's how I'm seeing it. I, I hate the man and oh man, I, 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 oof. That's all I gotta say is oof. Like, it's his lust. Like, if he could have just s put his own personal feelings aside and thought about the greater picture other than himself. This whole thing could have been avoided. Chelbert would be alive, and he would have probably gotten Valhalla one day. If I do play Odyssey, I am going to be playing uh, the female character in that one. Because I'm pretty sure she's the canon protagonist for one. And two, I hear from a lot of people that she's got the better uh, voice lines in that game. But it also would have to wait because I do not have the money to play Odyssey and get all of the DLC as well at the moment. So it's a game that I would probably wait and play. care about more arrows i don't i don't play with bows and arrows so i don't care if i have my arrows max out much better character get on sale you've got a lot of this game yet i'm going to sleep uh go to sleep now i am freaking tired have a good rest of your stream oh thank you so much natara it's always an honor to see you I love having you in my chat. Um, I don't know. I really like Eivor about being a better character and such. I, I really like Eivor. I like him a lot. I, I freaking love him. Um, as uh, we will be, we won't have a stream tomorrow, the Torah, in case you're still here, uh, but we will be back Friday. We're going to start an hour earlier. So just uh, letting you know about that. Thank you so much for being here. You, you sleep well. Uh, let's see here. Oh, it's that. Okay, going down. Do we have to climb this thing? Probably. Probably. Going. Oh, 
Moving up some more. Congratulations, Dax. There's someone uh, I officially hate more than you. never run out of arrows really so I'm not really in all that big of a hurry I want to go back here because there's a lot of stuff around here and I want to explore this area too That's a long way down. Let's not and say we did. <sighs> it's a very long way down. Destination cannot be reached. What do you mean a destination cannot be reached? Okay, listen here. Okay, now my destination can be reached. Thank you. Nugget, what are your thoughts on the events of this story arc? What do your what do you think about it? And also, the Blood Eagle. <sighs> Definitely plays with your emotions. Yeah. The Blood Eagle thing was really hard for me to watch. I know they didn't show anything. But man, that was hard for me to watch. really rough for me to watch it's probably underground yeah it's underground so before I do that I've seen it in Vikings and it showed it all ooh ooh ah uh, pretty gruesome yeah I'm not sure um, am I even gonna be able to watch that because uh, man just hearing about it made me kind of wince almost almost throw up i'm gonna be honest it, I, it almost made me throw up um it, I, I i there's a certain level of gore that i can handle and that was exceeding it if i had to what mm -mm.
So there's just a whole bunch of Yeah, I don't want to jump down there. So, uh, how much is this, like, Vikings nugget? How much would you say is this, like, Vikings? I mean, in general. That's all the treasure. be something over there man that water's pretty uh, it's a pretty good it's a pretty good show uh, the, at least for me I meant uh, the game uh, AC Valhalla compared to um, compared to uh, Vikings how similar are they because I've heard a lot of people say oh if you like this you'll like Vikings um, so I'm wondering from someone in my chat on how similar the two are to explain oh you don't have to explain then it's fine so I want to go everything there but it's not necessary My cat's just curled on on the floor. <sighs> okay. Uh, I want to go over here.
Hey, puppers. Yep, my kitty is a sweep. He's just kind of, he he's he's an old ball of fluff at this point. He's just. So one problem I do have is since Ivar is supposed to be so knowledgeable about uh, Viking lore, if the player isn't, it's an issue. Does that make any sense? Like, if the player is not knowledgeable about anything in, um, in the game, then it kind of doesn't explain it to you. And you just kind of have to, oh, well, I guess, show, don't tell. So, I didn't know what a blood eagle was, but then I, I saw it happen. So, they showed me instead of telling me. So, I appreciate, I can appreciate that. Okay. Been enough killing. I'm gonna leave the deer alone. Music is gorgeous. Music is so pretty. The music is very pretty. The game is pretty in general. Like... This is that this this game is one of the most breathtaking games I've played all year. It probably is the most breathtaking game. Um I don't know. Do I want to play that again? Like I was thinking like do I want to do a play for, through a Final Fantasy 14? Um not 14. Uh 15? 15. 15. Yes, 15 um the 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 open world rpg and because open world realistic action combat rpgs and all that um but i don't know i kind of i'm still kind of mad at them uh, blatantly lying to their community. Is there anything around here? There is. There's some... 
some stuff there some stuff there but for the most part I'm done um for the most part I'm finished um I've got one minute so yeah let's just end the stream here I think this is a so somber thing um I probably there will be again no stream tomorrow uh so let's go to stream and and see who's streaming okay let's see here let us see here let us see here hmm hmm who's streaming rogue mako is streaming she's cool i really like rogue rogue's a sweetheart i i, I dig rogue a lot I really do dig, uh, dig Rogue. She's playing a D&D style game called For the King, um, which looks super cute and super fun. Rogue is uh, a, a super chill streamer, so if you guys will join me in in that stream, that raid, that would be awesome. Uh, look at all those raiders. Man, you guys are awesome. I'm, I'm so happy to see whenever I, I raid, there's people that I can do it, so uh, people I can raid uh, with so that we can uh get get uh get some hype going and get some love and other streamers that's that that's something i always wanted to do um and still still do so anyways guys uh no stream today no stream tomorrow we're going to be streaming again um friday um and we'll be starting at 5 p.m mountain time instead and going till to uh 10 mountain so if you guys want to join me on that that would be awesome until then um i will hope you guys have an amazing thursday and i will see you guys around bye